Am I the astronaut for leaving my friend and her newborn on the side of the road? Oh, shoot. It involves a kid. Baby. I, 29 female, was driving my friend, 30 female, back from a wedding with her newborn baby through Arizona. We were on one of those two-lane highways, and I was passing big rigs that were going too slow. She was rudely critiquing me and telling me that my driving was unsafe, and I told her to stop whining or I would make her and her baby get out. She then continued to do it, so I pulled over into the breakdown area, and I told her to get out or I wouldn't drive. I offered for her to leave her baby with me, but she refused, so I kicked him out too. Apparently, her phone was at 5% and she wasn't able to get a ride for a few hours before she used some random person's phone to call an Uber, which cost a lot. She is constantly rude about my driving when I'm simply trying to drive efficiently. She's now insisting that I pay for her Uber and I apologize but refused because it's her fault that she got kicked out. Am I the astronaut? Uh, yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> let me get this straight. You were... <sighs> on a two lane highway passing big rigs that were going too slow. That's your version of this. I assume your friend's version of this was you were driving entirely unsafely and with an, an infant in the car to boot. So um, I, I would speak up too. I'd be like, Hey, Hey, yo, Hey, can you just, you know, try not to kill us? That'd be great. Um, and then kicking them out. Like if it was just your friend, that would be one thing you'd be like, screw off. But you knowingly, no, not even like a rest stop, not a place with with any kind of shelter or anything, just a breakdown area like like the shoulder, like a, a wider shoulder. You just kicked her and her baby out, forcing them to to leave or to sit there for hours. Yeah, that's an asshole thing to do. Um, also, you <clears throat> if you were a parent in this situation, it would be a child endangerment, right? Even though you're leaving her there with another adult, you put you put this child in a in a dangerous situation on the side of a road. I'm not okay with it. I think it is a I'd be pissed. Let's just say um, if if somebody ever did this when my kid was involved, I would be furious. And the fact that that OP here is like, well, I told her to stop complaining. I kick the baby out too. I don't think I'm the asshole. You got yourself kicked out. Okay. How about you just, you have a kid in the car. How about you just drive just a little more calm for a little bit to not, you know, make everybody's butt pucker up the fabric of your seats while you're driving the whole time. Yeah, I'm going to go and throw you all the way up here to ask on one because that is a shite, shite, shite thing to do. And her phone is at 5%. Um, yeah, obviously her phone not being charged is not your fault, but it is just more evidence to say that you shouldn't have kicked her out and put them in a precarious position. You saying that she put herself in that position by speaking up about the safety of your driving? <laughs> I took the scenic group. You make it the last ride you gave her, not at not risking the baby. I would have just made it the last ride I gave her, not risking the baby, Ashley says. Yeah, you know what? Um, I, I think it all comes down to the kicking them out on the side of the road with the baby. If that one thing had to happen and you got to a next gas station or a restaurant or something and you were like, okay, call call a ride. It'd be a different situation, but I think the the level of assholery is proven here by the willingness to kick a baby out on the side of the road be like, hey, it's just not an okay situation to put a kid in a situation like that. Good gravy. Yeah, not okay. 100% not okay. Not a fan. 